That's some good ass coffee. Hey guys, it's your boy, it's Shadow, and welcome back to the channel. Today's video, yeah, before actually before the video actually starts, um, I have been very, very, very fucking tired in the past few days, and um, I just gotta say I haven't gotten any sleep recently, and um. My fucking eyes are hurting, but I've been trying to get my... I'm trying to fix my sleep schedule. That's the reason why I didn't go live stream on Friday, because some shit was happening. Um, I recently just got my computer done, which the sad part was I really couldn't transfer into the ATX Typhon, so that's a that's a big-ass rip. But um, at the same time... Um, one, well, which is that complete, so... I would try to do a video about that probably like next time. I I try to if anything doesn't pop up in any way, shape, or form. But you may be asking yourself, "Phone, will you shut the fuck up while I'm talking?" I heard you click a clink and shit. But uh, half of you guys, you guys are amazing. But people, guys, I know you're obsessed with me trying to fucking you know. Do more content about Fantasy Star Online too. Well, I can't because why? I don't have the fucking game. Well, I can't fucking play the game on my fucking PC. Well, I don't know if I can because why? It's a lot of dumb shit. Also, my fucking um, like it's still like I said, it's not on our consoles yet. We don't know when it's coming to our console. But let me actually get this out the way. Every fucking time. Like, every time. Every time. So, anonymous people, I'm not saying their names, because why? I don't do that shit. I don't fucking diss out people and just say, like, oh, hey. Like, Susan just send me, tell me, they're like, hey, bro, do this, bro. You, you you will get some juicy-ass content. But, also, um, disclaimer, I'm not gonna fucking, um, show any screenshots of what the fuck I saw. All I gotta say, it's a lot of cringy-ass shit. And, um... Please, God, help me. And also, I'm not going to show any screenshots because some vulgar shit happened on my Twitter DMs recently. So, um, also, the results ended in the block. So, yeah. So, okay, a few friends of mine on Twitter has sent me like, Hey, Shadow, did you know that Fantasy Star Online 2 had an official Discord server? I'm like, yeah, yeah it's a piece of shit. And... But I was kind of curious. I was like, okay, I'm kind of curious of what the fuck type of cringe fest this shit is. Bro. I never seen any fucking dumbass bullshit in my fucking life. I saw a lot of shit that I know I shouldn't have be seen. And I asked myself, am I in the right Discord server? Nah, bro. I, went, I just went back to sleep after this. This shit happened like around Sunday. And, um... Like, Sunday of this week. Like, lat before... Today's Monday. I may post this tomorrow on Tuesday. I don't know. We'll see. But, on Sunday, I would sleep almost for, like, half of the whole fucking day. And I was having some... I was having a good dream, guys. I'm just gonna deadass tell you guys this. I was having a good-ass fucking dream. Woke up and shit to fucking... My phone was blowing up. Like, not like the batteries blowing up. Like, fucking ringing, 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 and ringing and shit. And I just gotta say, bro. Holy fucking shit. I never seen no person obsessed about getting my fucking ID in my fucking life. And I was like, and I, okay, I woke up like around like 5 41 in the afternoon about to turn six and it's about to be fucking dark around five o'clock at the afternoon and so bleh, Words I'm tripping on my own words at the moment But like I said, I woke up like around 551 5 no 541 in the afternoon It's about to be dark as shit. I'm about to head to the store I'm looking at my phone and all I see this girl on my fucking Twitter because okay recently I just gotta tell you guys this. I cut off all fucking DMs in my fucking, um, Discord. You have to be friends with me. So if you're friends with me, congratulations. You're just friends with me. You can contact me wherever the fuck you want. But 
on Twitter. Oh, for fuck's sake, she probably went through all my fucking socials and shit now. This this girl is a whole fucking stalker and shit. I, I was scared. I was fucking scared for my da goddamn life. And, and I was looking at all these messages. Send this shit per fucking hour. Each fucking hour. And I, I went through this whole fucking message shit. I was like, okay, it can't be that bad, right? Oh, fuck no, nah, bro. I just gotta say... I never... Like, I, I never fucking disrespected a woman in my fucking life. But this might be the first woman I might disrespect in my goddamn life. So... Well, it's for teachers. Teachers are still women, but... Like an actual girl, a e e-girl. I never disrespected a girl in my fucking life. I was supposed to be raised, like, as a fucking gentleman. Nah, bro. I know who she was. And it's the girl that who's a thought. And, yeah. And all I saw was my fucking DMs and shit. Like, hey, send a... F hey, like, um, what's your ARC ID? What's... Hey, can you send me your ARC ID? What's your ARC ID? What it said it over and over and over per hour. Like I said, I'm not gonna show any fucking DM messages because I'm not that disrespectful. Like just for like cloud and some shit, but it's not for cloud. It's actually some cringy ass shit that I wanna fucking just just wanna put a fucking bullet through my head and shit, man. But like I'm saying, the last message kind of fucking put me off in a bad spot. And I said, I see you have a Steam ID. I'm like, what the fuck? I didn't say anything about a Steam ID. Like, I didn't even tell you my fucking Steam name. Like, I forgot. My fucking Discord showed me my fucking shit. So, that's a, that's a, that's a, that's a dumbass move by my end. But hey, like, it, it doesn't show, like, password or anything. Thank fucking Lord. But, like, um... Like, she went through my whole fuck. she went through my game, she went through my fucking profile, I'm like, then she didn't even know who the fuck I was, I think, she didn't even watch, she even watched my fucking videos, I think, I don't fucking know, I think she was one of them who disliked it, I, I, I don't know, like I said, I don't know, I was like, I told her, like, god damn, you a whole fucking stalker too? Like, shit, like, like, can you please back the fuck off, off my fucking socials, please, I, I feel very uncomfortable. And she said, like, well, you don't play the game, so, sorry. And I was like, what? Like, I went through this, okay, like I said, like, the whole cringy-ass community of Fantasy Star Online 2. Bro, it's so fucking cringe, and I, I just, I kind of just puked, and, like, I, I, I choked on fucking pizza while I was eating and w looking through this fucking shit. I almost fucking died. Like, dead ass. I thought I was not going to make it at that point, but, um, just, Jesus, like, I saw, like, okay, I'm just going to describe this, that fucking server is just fucking pedo central, it's fucking pedo central, fucking cringy ass central, I mean, like, even some fucking dumbass big YouTubers are in that fucking shit, and I just gotta say, bro, like, the, and also, the fucking server ban you for no fucking reason, first of all. Like, I know, like, term of services and everything, but Jesus fucking Christ. If you're gonna ban, for, if you're gonna ban somebody, at least have a fucking excuse, you know what I'm saying? Like, um, like, they, okay, they banned me because I didn't, um, apply to giving them my fucking mark, my arc. ID or some shit. I'm like, for just to give you my fucking ID, bitch, I don't even fucking own the goddamn game yet. I mean, I don't even fucking play the fucking game yet. And you want me to give you my fucking ID? Yeah, go fuck yourself, buddy. And like, okay. And also, the, the girl who's the thought from her other server, which I, you know, the first two videos that I did about Fantasy Star Online 2, like the Cringe Fest, and then I'm Public Enemy Number 1, if you guys remember that. The link is down in the description down below. But, I'm, I told myself, like, she looks familiar. And, I never, okay. Remember when I said I never dissed on a female before? Well, this might be the first female I might diss on my whole fucking life. This girl look like fucking Ollie London, but at least she's not worse yet. And, and plus, also, I just gotta say, I, bro, I don't even want to fucking be traumatized anymore for what I saw. 
Like, I knew she was from somewhere, but I just told myself, like, just, just Shadow, just keep your fucking comments to yourself. Oh, I didn't do that. I currently just told her to, um, I said some fucked up shit that I wasn't proud for afterwards, but shit, at the same fucking time, she deserved it. Why? Because she was fucking over-exaggerating and keeps sending me fucking DMs saying like, hey, give me your fucking ID or some shit. I fucking blocked her like after this shit. I was like, you know what? Fuck this cringy ass community. I'm done. Like, it's gay. It's done. I mean, it, like, okay, this needs to stop actually. This shit needs to stop right fucking now. Before someone get hurt or killed or get killed like in some like in fucking Travis Scott concert that happened in fucking Astral World or some shit. Like I know it's like hey, I know it's too soon to say that shit. But it's fucking getting out of hand in my opinion. Like, um Okay, I'm trying to find the words here that like um okay, I'm gonna close my door real quick so no one won't hear me think I'm fucking having a seizure or some shit. So Multiple people have been, like, going out of pocket. Like, they said, like, hey, don't forget about that content. Okay, number one, you guys remember the, like, the launch of NGS? Yeah, that shit was a fucking shit fest. Why? They kept milking the fucking game. Um, the fucking, quote-unquote, desert release. That shit is gonna have a fucking shit fest as well. I'm not a fucking doomer. I'm not a fucking doom gloomer or whatever the fuck they, people want to call it. Like, I'm not a fucking doomer. I just, I just think that shit is gonna be, like, if they keep fucking milking the damn desert on, like, every social media or on fucking YouTube and shit, the game will be fucked entirely. Like, okay, Final Fan, for an example, Final Fantasy XIV um, might be the last extension, aka Endwalker, right? Endwalker was got delayed two weeks. Two fucking weeks later, because why? The developer kind of like, oh shit, I feel sorry for actually rushing this fucking shit. Oh, like, oh, like, I think this game deserve a better chance, you know, with a lot of fucking shit in this ga goddamn game. Uh oh, excuse me. But, he's just like, oh, I'm gonna delay it two weeks because I feel bad this game might be rushed or some shit. He delayed his fucking expansion. But with PSO2, no, they just keep fucking milking the goddamn shit and think they're fucking hot shit. No. No, like, it's... And plus, also, I'm gonna have to put this out for, like, for the people who are content hungry. Like, people... Actually, okay, like I said in the previous videos, people fucking premature coming and shit. Like, they fucking... Like they ate some hot crack or some shit because they heard the word content. Bruh, calm your fucking content head ass down, bro. Because, one, number one, if you fucking finish the content and just say like, Oh, this game don't have any more content. I fucking hate this game now. You fucking dry your fucking self out when it comes to shit like this. When it comes to fucking content, you're gonna fucking dry yourself out. Take your fucking time. Paste it. Play something else. Play games like fucking Call of Duty Warzone or some shit. Get fucking shit on. Be angry about that. That's the least thing you want to get fucking pissed off at. And But, um, I'm not going to fucking try to hot dog anything or any shape or form. But, Sword Art Online, Alicization Lycris, it should get more content than PSO2. I'm not even fucking capping. Like, with the recent DLCs, I mean, god damn, the size. The fucking size of this game now is like almost 90 fucking gigabytes. And quality don't mean shit. It's the size of the game. And is that mean it's how much content's in this fucking godforsaken game. But. <clears throat> like, I, that's not me being a fucking fanboy for the fucking series. It's just facts and opinion. But. Like, there's still, there's still shit for this game to do, like, and stuff for PSO2. PSO2, it's just like, oh, time limit, this shit's on time limit, live service still, oh, all this other hot shit, and, um, and I, t I just told myself, bruh, this game just needs to calm down, like, Fantasy Star Online 2 needs to calm down when it comes to fucking content or, 
like fixing shit like okay fixing shit is should be their number one priority but something always have like okay video games ain't perfect like i said like in previous videos i think games are not perfect okay it's always gonna have a bug it's something stupid is gonna fucking happen but okay the reason why games like fucking Call of Duty Vanguard or any Call of Duty titles for now, like from Cold War, Modern Warfare, um, Warzone, now Vanguard, it doesn't work well on Xbox. I'm not shit shaming or anything else, shape or way or form. That's fucking true. The game doesn't work. Games don't work well on that. And now, here goes Fantasy Star Online 2, a Japanese-made game on a Japanese-made console in Japan. An American bragging over to the middle, I mean, not to the Middle East, to the fucking, shut up phone, to the, um, to the, you know, to the North, because why well, Sega suck their dick, of course, they, they fucking suck anybody else's dick except for PlayStation, I mean, like, give PlayStation a chance, but now, recently, um, Sega and Microsoft kind of made a deal for certain games to be released on certain platforms, but... I'm not trying to fucking milk the shit out of this, but I think the Switch version is coming out this year. Maybe. Don't get your hopes up. Just don't, like, we still got the Game Awards to look forward to. Like, the Game Awards still have, like, a lot of crazy shit that happens out of fucking thin air. Like, it's fucking, like, just whip out, like, it just whipped its dick out and just pull it out a fucking magic hat or some shit. It, it, just look forward to the goddamn Game Awards or some shit. Like, we still, like, it's a lot of shit that's going on happening. But... Just like I mean, also with that, um, that even though like a long time back they they even said Fantasy Star Online Two is not an Xbox exclusive, not because it's not on the Steam Store, Epic Game Store, or the Micro Shit Store in any way, shape, or form. That's because why console exclusivity is over for that game. We just waiting on for PlayStation and Switch to just give them the green light. It's just like hey. Um, we're ready for this game to be on our consoles now, but it, it's just fucking crazy. But now, like, back what I was saying about why games can't run well on Xbox. Well, it's no, 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 no. What the fuck, bro? <laughs> Ah, uh, shit just cut off in mid-sentence, no. God damn it. How could you? But, but yeah, it, certain games kind of made a deal with the certain company, so. With that being said, Call of Duty works very well on PlayStation and Xbox nowadays. It's kind of fucked up. But, um, yeah, like I said, guys, calm the fuck down when it comes to fucking content. That shit ain't going away. I mean, like, yeah, maybe Fantasy Star Online 2 New Genesis might be fucking closing down in a year or two. Because why? Financial problems. Sega dumbasses. And people who don't know how to fucking work well with fucking games and shit. I mean, when Yakuza Online was in Japan, I don't know how long that shit been up. But somebody please give me the research on that. Because if Yakuza Online been on for lasted than this piece of shit, I mean, than that piece of shit game... I'm sorry, but Yakuza is better than than any other fucking IP and fucking Sega. But like the Yakuza Caesar series, like Judgment, Yakuza, even the fucking spinoff for Yakuza with the samurais and shit. I just, I just, I don't know. But yeah, like like I'm saying, just calm your asses down with this fucking content shit. It makes me feel like that. Also. With the community being all cringy like and shit, like memeing off of fucking Virgil, that made me want to, that made me want to puke. It didn't make me want to kill myself. It made me want to puke, memeing for off of other shit. And plus, motherfuckers don't even know what fucking memes, like what movie it came from. I'm like, you don't know what that came from. I'm like, okay, for an example, somebody used something of a meme off of the, you know, guys know the movies, The Woods, right? The Woods. Um, somebody memeing off of that shit, and I'm told myself, I'm like, bruh, 
you don't even know what movie that came from. Like, please go get educated. I, like, I don't think he was. I don't think he knew, but. Oh, excuse me. But, um. Yeah, and plus, also, I forgot to tell you guys this. They need to update their term of services. I, that's all I gotta say. Fantasy Star Online 2 need to update their fucking term of services. One. It's because of fucking bullshit like um, people from different countries, people speaking different language. Like, okay, say like, for an example, Japanese, Korean, um, Mexican. Like, say like someone said, um, hola, como estas? Or um, Ohio, because I must die. Oh, fuck, I'm trying to, not, trying to not fuck the language up. But, um, you know, say anything, you know, saying I, I got to because I must and shit, but say like, say, it's just say like you said something in a different language, bam, you get banned say like you just fucking chilling in a lobby or just, you know, playing the fucking game people fucking false reporting you or some shit, well, they ban you that for that too, supposedly, I don't know why and then now th hear my only opinion about this one I think they should just only ban like people who are like, um like hacking or duplicating items or duplicating red box or some shit. Look. Just. They need to do that. Uh, there's a lot of shit need to be fixed though, in my opinion. But like I, it's too much shit to say. Because I'm not trying to waste anybody's time to say this. But just seriously. This shit needs to stop. Before like you know. Something bad happens to the company or someone go to the fucking company and send them death threats. I mean, have you guys heard of this guy named Josh or some shit? Josh 1994 or some shit? He, this motherfucker threatened a, a K-pop star because why? If he if she was secretly dating, she's gonna fuck. He gonna fucking kill her ass. That's that's the type of bad I'm talking about right there. But hey, it's. It's their fault if something stupid happens. So, yeah, with that being said, um, this has been your boy Shadow. I'll catch you guys in another video because why? Fuck this shit, bro. Make me. Ugh. I'll catch you guys later. <laughs>